Starting in January 1939, for the next three years almost all of the bigger American radio manufacturers began to sell wireless record players. The basics are rather simple. A multigrid tube, here a 35L6 pentode, is used to mix a carrier BC frequency and the phono cartridge output signal to produce an AM modulated high frequency signal around 580 kHz, which is transmitted through an antenna to any nearby radio capable of receiving the AM BC band. These phonographs are so jaw dropping and mind blowing that for a long time kits based on the original design were sold until the early 1960s. Being produced 10 years before 33 RPM was introduced by Columbia and 45s by RCA, these record players are strictly 78 RPM only, in very beautiful Bakelite or wooden cabinets and in open air design without cover. Originally they were equipped with heavy tone arms and aesthetic steel needle cartridges that are not very healthy for 78s. All my vintage record players are equipped with new ceramic flip-flop diamond or sapphire needle jukebox cartridges and have tone arm weight reducing springs installed. By providing an extra plug, also devices like cell phones, MP3 players, etc. can be connected to the same transmitter to appear in your AM radio. Here we go. Oh, yeah. 